Greetings, Divine Infinite Light Beings. The camera just started by itself. And um, Divine Masculine or Divine Feminine asked me to return and to clear up the last um, comment or message that they had made with the night the, the the king of swords when i said that they were still using their head over their heart well in this case they are using their head over their heart when it comes to their family ashe or whoever they're trying to move away from ashe they're not um using their heart as they would in the past when it comes to the third party situation now they want to save their heart for you i say they want to bring it to you i say and so they wanted me to come back and clear it up because we had got this in the last um message and i said they were still using their head over their heart like but they're like no not when it comes to you when it comes to the third party that manipulated them took them for granted um misused them abused them you know gaslighted them lied to them jealous of you i say um lied on you you know um talk bad down on you you know because this divine masculine or this divine feminine truly loves you i say confirmation they truly see you as one that they could spend their life with i say the rest of their life with i say they truly understand that y'all have spent many of lifetimes together i say and so um now they want to you know use their head over their heart when it comes to their family because usually you know you love family you love friends you love children you love people you've worked with for umpteen years and two years and this that and the other whatever the case may be for you i say um but <coughs> The karmic don't want you to know this. The family don't want you to know this. The best friend don't want you to know this. You understand me? They just don't want you to know because they don't want this king of swords to leave them behind for you. Uh, uh, you? Wait, homie. Um, I thought you was my bitch. Girl, what are you doing? Like, and you... You really finna leave us behind for, you know, someone you probably barely know or someone you've been back and forth with or someone, you know, you had a baby with or someone, you know, you, you, you want to get to know or, you know, whatever the case may be for you, Ashe. And so, yeah, he wants to leave. She wants to leave them behind. And this is um, air sign and cancer. You don't have to be. You know, these signs. Don't take the signs so so um, meaningfully because we all embody every sign in the Zach Zodiac. So somebody's name could be Zach. In the Zodiac, we embody all 12 signs. We in, in every different chart, in our chart, we have a part of that, the 12 house sign. So... You know, take these messages as they resonate, you know. Don't get too caught up in the signs. You, you, you it's the feelings. It's the feelings. It's the intuition. It's the discernment. And my stomach is hungry. <laughs> Somebody could be hungry. I don't know, I'm hungry. Somebody feed me. No, I mean. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, somebody um, misses your cooking? I just felt that. Um, somebody misses eating some... Yeah, somebody... So both of you could like to cook. Because someone is missing your cooking as well as you're missing eating someone's cooking. So both of you could like to cook. I say, but yeah... Um, he's cutting, she's cutting um, things that no longer serve them, no longer um, is benefiting them, no longer is um, making them happy to come for their wish fulfillment. 
whether they be a feminine energy or masculine energy, they see you as their wish, for, wish fulfillment. They see you as their wish fulfillment. And they, the way they cross their hands is like they're not going to um, let it be until they get their wish fulfillment. It's like, I'm not giving up on this. Um, I'm not, I'm not going to stop until I get this. Like, this is my boundary and I'm not going to stop until, you know, I set my boundary in. And their boundary is you. I say, so now they know they they should have held boundaries when it came to you. I say, and so this is what they want to do. They want to hold the boundaries for you and against anyone that comes against you. I say, this is what they want. This is what they want. They want to be happy and they want to surprise you too. They've been dreaming about this. They've been dreaming about this new love having with you. This could be, um, you know, your 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 wife, your husband, your ex-wife, your ex-husband, your counterpart, um, your um, we what we know is your counterpart. This could be, you know, your your common law marriage, you know, your baby daddy, your baby mama, you know, situationships, your boo thing, you know. Um, so, yeah, they want, and um, we got this last night. They know they're getting intuitive messages. Y'all, y'all, y'all are um, telepathically communicating, you know, um, probably teleporting to each other, you know, you, um, but that you're getting messages, you're, you're, you're so in tune, you're so in sync, because this is a divine connection that is protected by your spiritual love war team and their spiritual love war team. The creator of all there is wants this divine connection for the two, you know, the two of cups, you know, and that lover's energy. I say, and so, yeah, they they want this new love, whether they be a feminine energy or masculine energy. This is why they're taking control. This is why they're standing in their truth. Now they want to stand in their truth of being in love with you. Spirit is saying, I say, um, truthfully, honestly, you know, clarity, they're taking authority, confirmation, you see how that came right out after authority, they're standing their grounds now, you know, because they, they know they love you, they know this is of the divine, this fish, this is the, the symbol of Jesus, you know, they love their, they, they, they know they love you and they want to be creative when it comes to getting back into your presence they want to be creative I say <clears throat> yeah they said you know <laughs> them coming back to you is only going upward you know Them coming back to you will help them recover. Y'all can re rejuvenate together. You know? Coming up out of this Ten of Swords. Coming up out of this ending. They don't want it to be ended no longer. They don't want it to be ended no longer. They're having an emotional loss without you. I say, this, here he is. Here she is. Having an emotional loss without you. They can't stand to be without you. We, we, we heard that. I can't breathe without you. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, something else is coming to me, but I can't, you know. Here he is. Very stable. Very stable. She, very stable. King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, take the messages as they resonate for you. 
but they want to bring this stability to you, stand in the grounds for you, you know, being that protector and that provider, being that protector and that provider. They ready to chop off heads for you now, literally. Trying to have the strength. What is this? Manifesting. Manifesting. Being that master manifester that they're supposed to be. That they know they are. The alchemist that they know they are. They're, they're attracting you. They're, they're going to attract you back. They're going to come to you, Ashe. But they're going to attract you. They're not going to... Um, They're not going to just let it be. They're going to attract you back. They're manifesting it. They're going to take bold action is what they're going to do. They're going to fucking get some self-confidence. Get out of that motherfucking insecurity. Dust their shoulder off and fucking try again. As if you, at first you don't succeed. What would she say? Dust, your, dust the shit off. Dust yourself and try again. Dust yourself and try again. The, you know, whatever shoulder you got a motherfucking dust. Um, counterpart, the one that is needing to take action. Dust that shit off and try again. As if she say, if first you don't succeed, dust yourself off and try again. You know, or what Jay-Z say, um, pop your collar, what the fuck? Something about a fucking pop in the collar, you know, so somebody could like to wear their collars popped, you know, like up and, you know, snazzy, you know, real, like, neat, gentleman-like, you know, some type shit. So, um, yeah, um, but they want to bring clarity. They're trying to have willpower, you know, they're being real skillful about it because they got to sneak around some demons to get to <laughs> They got to sneak around some, with two, two, two on the clock. They got to sneak around some demons to get to you. Ashe, um, yeah, they do. But they're manifesting. They're, they're in their manifesting powers. They're being the master manifester right now, Ashe. They see the candle is lit on both ends. They're, they're ready. They got their chalice. They, they got the infinity. They cloaked. You know, they see abundance. They standing in the light of spirit. They're ready. They're ready. Because they're tired of this shit. They tired of not sleeping. They tired of wondering what the fuck you doing at night. Because they don't, you know, there's no communication. You could be doing anything at night, you know? They don't know, so they're up all night. They're trying to have the strength to hold on, you know? They're, they're, they're you know, very depressed about this shit. Like, if you have spurts of depression, it's not you, it's them. It's you feeling them. And remember, spirit can't, confirmation, spirit cannot touch on enough to send your counterpart true healing energy we all know that we as divine infinite light beings have that true energy because you are that healer you are that empath you are that um earth angel that cosmic seed that golden child i say whichever one you want to you know choose to use or you are all of them wrapped in one i say that reiki healer that shamic healer you know so um you have the power to heal from a distance, I say. So remember that. Never doubt your powers. You have a power to heal from a distance. And right now, you are at a distance. We've seen that chariot. You are at a distance from your counterpart. So spirit is advising you, urging you, um, nudging you to send that healing power to your divine counterpart because you are supposed to be in connection 
you will have more abundance with being in connection than apart. And spirit wants the abundance for you in your life. This is why spirit divinely guided you back in this lifetime. That's why your ancestors, spirit guides, intuition, higher self have all been communicating with you and your divine counterpart. Because this is a meant to be situation. This is not no maybe, could it be, should it be, if I could, if I could have, should have, would have. It's not one of those, if I could have, should have, would have. It's not one of those, if I could have, should have, would have. It is a meant to be divinely orchestrated, divinely ordained. Use your discernment. Use your discernment. Somebody needs your, your, your love. Somebody needs your ten, tender love. Love so tender, holding you close to me. Baby, I surrender. You know, um, y'all might get tired of me singing these songs, but this is y'all divine counterparts' energy. You understand me? Um, and if they're still in this energy, this is what they're in. You know, I can't produce anything that um, is of a lie, is a false, you know. I can't do that. So I can only give you what they are giving me. Ashe, um, like I said, these are messages. Spirit has been here all day. Um, I can't have my protective um, um, energy going, the, the um, incense, because someone wants to choke the shit out of me. And somebody wants to choke the shit out of you from your past. You understand me? You know it as well as I know it. And so right now I'm giving myself a break of that, you know, just for me. So, um, if you're wondering why I didn't, um, invoke the spirits, the spirits are here. They've been here all day. I've been here all day. Y'all have seen me here all day. And when I'm not on camera, I'm still lighting incense. I'm still meditating. I'm still invoking energies. Um, our spiritual love war team energies are still always divinely here with us and I just want to show you right now um, I'm going to take this picture right because this is this is <clears throat> this is how y'all are in the moment confirmation This is my lovebirds. Can you see that? Those are my lovebirds. They're knocked over. They're off balance. They're not in sync, right? This is how my lovebirds usually sit, in sync, in love, in balance, together. You see that shit? That's how spirit wants you. In sync, in love, balance, together. <coughs> Confirmation. I speak only um, the truth of spirit here. I give only the messages of spirit here. You do realize that you're every Shut the fuck up. <laughs> and so, yeah, yeah, with one thirty one zero three three on the clock. I shade spirit. What else do you have for the divine infinite light beings in this um, pleasant moment? They recognize you, who you are who you been, what you came to do, where you came from, 
and where y'all going. They see it. They see it. They understand it. And they, they see that other people recognize what they were um, failing to acknowledge in the beginning. They see it now. You know, because remember Spirit said they had the blind, the wool over their eyes because of all the naysayers and the he say, she say, gossip, jealous type bitches, jealous type niggas that ran in and out their lives, Ashe, whether it be family, friends, co-workers, whoever, whoever, wherever, whatever. You understand me? That was, you know, putting that wool over their eyes so they couldn't see the truth of it all. They felt it, but they didn't want to see it. It's a difference. You know, they felt it. They were not explaining it or a, a expressing it as they should have. But they did not see it. You understand? It's a difference. You know, they they could keep their feelings to themselves. But when they got other people in their ear and on their back with that fucking ten of wands type bullshit... You know, like, like right now, I, and as I said that, it feels like something is on my back. This is how they feel, that heavy-ass motherfucking weight. You see how the synchronicity is? That heavy-ass fucking weight, you know, is on their back. And it's heavy. It's heavy. It's like, you know, I'm seeing a picture of a, a old, an elder, a wise one. You know, bent over, just old. But they're not, they could be old, they could be young, mind you. But this is the image in my head of how long they've been suffering with this burden. And the burden is just like way up to the sky of what they're carrying. You understand me? And that's a lot. But they recognize you. With 2211 on the clock and then 222 again. Ashe, Ashe. Here he is again. Bold. He, he, he ready. He ready to come up out of this shit. He ready to come up out of this shit. He's releasing negative thoughts. He's releasing negative thoughts. He's having an, an acceptance of his freedom. You know, this is the first time... I got these messages. Usually, he's in self-limited belief. But no, Spirit said he's releasing negative thoughts. Or she's releasing negative thoughts. Having um, acceptance. And having, um, setting their self free. You know, they want to be free like you, Divine Infinite Light Being. You know, they want to come up out of this disconnect with you. Spirit is saying, the shit that I'm saying is true. You know, they don't want any options they don't want any more illusions they made the choice they made they finally picked the right cup and the right cup is you and here it is here look at that shit i'm over it i'm over it like come on now come on with three two three 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 on the clock come on this is your divine counterpart they know it, you know it, spirit knows it. This this is your divine counterpart. And they're going to come in and tell you that they don't want no option. They only want you. They don't see nothing else but one cup. And with that one cup and their cup, that makes two. That's two of cups. All these other shits, all this other shit don't matter. Now, it don't matter. Once you, you know, made them fall right out of heaven... They realized they didn't need this shit. They didn't want this shit. None of this shit matters. This shit put them in this, this situation right here. So they only choosing to take one cup to, ma to match with their cup. And that's two of cups. Ashe? Ashe. And so I'm going to leave it here because I'm getting very heavy. You know, here we are again. They want it to be a another try. The Six of Wands and the Eight of Cups in reverse. Baby, can we try again? I recognize you love me. 
Baby, can we try again? I recognize you were loyal to me. Baby, can we try again? I recognize that you were the only one that could see through me. Baby, can we try again? Try, try. So I'm going to leave it there. I'm a little spark of light. The shit on their back is heavy. It's very, 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 very heavy. Okay, so if these messages don't resonate with you, leave them here for who they resonate with for. They can't be still. You see, I'm twirling in my chair. They can't be still. They up right now. I'm fucking up right now. I sleep at this time. I sleep. I sleep like a baby at this time. What the fuck? You, you feel me? You understand me? Like, come on now. Y'all need to work this shit out. Because I'm, I'm over it. <laughs> Y'all need to get it together. And get together. And do shit right. You understand me? If you don't understand me, understand spirit. Understand and overstand. The spirit has the hand of coverance over you come back together get it right do what you need to do make that good love and have a good night what the fuck but anyway <laughs> anyways um yeah quit being stranger things and get get together stop being stranger things and get together i don't know um i'm over this shit like fuck i'm just keeping it real um, anyways, if the messages don't resonate, leave them here for who they resonate with for, I say, because every message is not going to resonate with everyone, but if you have been a faithful and you have been following, this is your message because these messages have been synchronicity, you know, so, and if you are drawn to it and it resonates, then it resonates with you, I say, these messages are always timeless, past, present, and future, but us as infinite light beings, the faithful to the divine creator, infinite being of all there is, we thrive, we live, we stand, we have peace, we have abundance, we have joy, we have happiness, we have serenity, we have um, pure bliss, we have powerful manifestations, confirmation in the present we have full love and control of ourselves in the present understand understand overstand as so above as so below as so within as so without i say and so we are the divine creators infinite light beings i say i'm sending my love and healing energy your way be open to receive it and then pass it along don't just hold on to it pass it along and that way we all can receive and it's recycled back and forth you understand in a 360 i say so we can continue to spread and receive love as the divine creator wants us to do i don't know anyone could ever come over here and tell me how demonic i am there's nothing demonic about me. Ashe, in this moment, Spirit is saying, go look in the mirror and ask the mirror about you. Ashe, Ashe, and so, may the peace be in you as it is within me. Ashe, I love you all. Ashe, Ashe, have a very happy, pleasant moment of whatever day it is for you and help your divine counterpart get this heavy shit off they back and mine <laughs> I shake, I shake.